So here we are once again with Android and today we're going to cover how to enable the extra dim accessibility shortcut. Now this has a few benefits. First, you can actually quickly dim or undim the display with just the tap of the screen, just one tap. So that's going to be very helpful. Two, if you are working with your device, maybe you have it at the most dim setting without extra dim yet, but it's still too bright. Normally this happens in low light conditions where your display is just very blinding and you wanna make that display even more dim. You can do that here. And if you're like me, maybe you made the display too dim, you can't see it, you don't see any of the screen at all, and it's just hard to find out how to undim it. Well, with this quick accessibility shortcut here, you can just do one tap and brighten up the display. Now, I do have the shortcut enabled at the moment, but I'm going to do a walkthrough so that you can enable it yourself. So we're going to start by swiping down from the top of the display. And you may actually see the extra dim quick setting right in your top row here. And you can actually toggle it on and on will be that it's kind of illuminated or white and off will be that it's grayed out. Now, if you don't see it here, you may have to swipe down again to expand the full list of quick settings here. Now, as you can see, it's not on my first page and it's also not on my second page. And if this is the case for you, you're going to want to add it to the quick settings. So we're going to have this pencil icon right at the top there. We're going to tap on that. And then we're going to look at full here and we're going to tap edit. Then we're going to look for the quick setting extra dim. As you can see right there, we're going to press and hold and then just drag it anywhere. And then we're going to tap done. It's important that you tap done because if you just tap the back arrow, it won't save the configuration. So we're going to tap done here and then we can tap that back arrow in the bottom right hand corner. And then we can swipe down twice again here and it'll show up right here. Now you can actually toggle extra dim on or off right here as well. But if you press and hold on it, you get a few more extra features. So we're going to press and hold and we're going to get the extra features show up here. So this opens up an extra dim settings page and here we can toggle the feature on or off once again. Now beneath this, we're going to have our accessibility option. And once again, I have it enabled as seen here and as seen by the blue slider there, but I'm going to tap on the slider. It's going to turn gray and that accessibility option goes away here. Now I do want to enable it, so I'm going to tap on the slider and it's going to turn blue and we have that accessibility shortcut show up again. Now, interesting enough, you can choose a different accessibility option by just tapping on the blue text right underneath the text extra dim shortcut and that opens a new page here. And here we can toggle that accessibility shortcut off or on and beneath that, we can choose between three options. So first option is the one that I have selected now, tap accessibility button. Then we have press side and volume up buttons. And then we have press and hold volume up and down buttons for three seconds. I think those two options, the ones after the one I selected, they're a bit too complicated. I like something simple. And I like that this one is also on the display. So that's why I'm going with it. But you do have those two other options if you're interested. And once you select the one you like, we can tap either the back arrow in the top left hand corner or the back arrow at the bottom of the display here. And then we have intensity of the extra dim. Now I put it up completely. You may want to play with this, but the further to the right that it is, the more dim your display will be. The further to the left, the brighter the display will be. But I'm going to put it all the way to the right here and I'm going to actually turn it off because my display is going to be harder to see here. Now, lastly, we have a feature that I find very helpful. We have turn off after restart. So what this will do is after you restart your phone, it'll turn off the extra dim feature. That could be helpful because normally when you restart your device, you have to enter your pin or your password and you have to see the screen to do that. And as you can imagine, if extra dim is all the way on, 
you might not be able to see the display and it may be a lot harder for you to log into your phone. So anyways, that's how you enable the extra dim accessibility feature and that's how it works. Let us know in the comments down below if you're going to use this feature and what you think about it. And as always, thanks for watching and may the universe flow in your favor. And until next time, Leon check in out. Yeah.